Hey everybody, welcome back. Hope everybody is staying healthy and staying safe. Hope y'all had a, any mothers out there, hope y'all had a wonderful Mother's Day last week. That was last week. Um, apologies for the late upload today. I uploaded the one from last week. Just, you know, I was going to do it that Sunday. Didn't have time, but um, God, I need to. You trim up here. This is uh getting out of control. But um anyway. Got one today. <clears throat> Excuse me. That I've been eyeing for the past couple weeks. It's a Chicago brewery. And um yeah, I mean, you know, Illinoisan. Gotta support Chicago. I live in the Chicago land area. So you know, gotta support Chicago. This is from Half Acre Beer Co. And this is called Stacks of Wheat. It's a golden wheat ale. Looks delicious. Comes in a nice pint can. And um, yeah, it just looks absolutely great. And um, looking for 5%. Not um, not very heavy. And um, so once again, perfect summer beer, I'm thinking. You know, not very heavy. It's not going to slow you down at all. It's going to be very light. It's going to be very refreshing. And, um, yeah, let's get into it. I like weed ales. Weed ales are very, very good. Once again, one of those, uh, one of those tabs that's like really close to the, to the top. But, um, <clears throat> anyway, mm, smells really good. Got my nice ale glass here. We're gonna see how this looks. Looks absolutely amazing, of course. I mean, perfect color on there. So this is gonna be, um, where's that? Half Acre Beer Co. Stacks of Wheat, Golden Wheat Ale. Let's give it a shot, it smells delicious. I think I saw that on the camera. Something dripped off my uh, my uh, facial hair here, but um, apologies for that. <sighs> yeah, really light, really good, really refreshing, very crisp, um, very very good, and oof. This is, a, this is a good one. This is, uh, this one's kind of stumped me here. This is really good. I thought this was going to be like more, more just kind of, you know, you're like, I didn't think that, you know, like I didn't think it was going to be average. Otherwise I wouldn't, wouldn't have picked it, but, um, I didn't think it was going to be this good. This is, this is very good. Got that nice wheat flavor to it. That kind of, I don't know what you call it, what what wheat tastes like, but um, it's not very, like I said, not very heavy. It's only 5%, but uh, some, you know, some 5%, you know, can taste heavier. This is not, this is very crisp, very refreshing, very, um, very fulfilling. Not filling in your stomach, but just very, very fulfilling beer. <sighs> this was, I believe, um, like 10, 10, 48, something like that. Found it at Walmart and, um, yeah, 10, 48, not bad. I would definitely check it out for 1040. I would definitely buy it again as well. Uh, perfect cookout beer, definitely. You know, especially if you're over the hot grill. If you're the if you're the grill guy and you're cooking dogs and hamburgers and whatever else, corn on the cob all day long on the grill, this is perfect for that. 
it will cool you down it will refresh you it'll it'll just taste great and i'm thinking i'm thinking about the uh, the uh not the price the uh, scoring here i'm thinking it's like a it's like a 8.3 it's like an 8.3 definitely very good very very good and definitely buy it again definitely try it if you haven't already definitely support chicago because chicago has some amazing amazing breweries around chicago and the chicago land area so i mean definitely support chicago and the chicago land area so another thing i kind of like this is a little extra like i say you know sometimes the can or the bottle catches my eye the graphics i really like the um kind of like the painted uh painting look of uh just you know a, a field looks looks very tranquil looks very very peaceful and um yeah and i think that says the graphic says about the beer it's something to relax with this is a very relaxing scene on the can and this is this could be a very relaxing beer i mean you know not just in the summertime i don't think i think it could be in the fall i believe it could be excuse me i believe it could be um you know in the winter time anything like that any season i believe and actually now that I'm actually really like staring at the can, um, so I I am assuming this is Art Institute, um, Chicago or Art Incentive, excuse me, Art Incentive Monet and Chicago. So I'm assuming this is like a <laughs> people are gonna be like you you're dumb you don't know what that is I don't know this could be like a a famous painting that I don't know. But um I'm not very like big into knowing what paintings are. I do like looking at paintings and you know seeing the beauty of what what an artist has made. I do like looking at that stuff. But um this I mean I just I love this scene. It's it's just so tranquil, so peaceful, so relaxed, such a relaxing um scene to put on a to put on a label i mean it's just it's just absolutely amazing so 8.3 10 40 something i don't know four pack pint cans definitely worth it go check it out and uh yeah like i said it is a crisp crisp refreshing fulfilling relaxing wheat ale So that's going to be it for me. I'm definitely going to try to remember to upload this tomorrow. Um, and like I said, I apologize for the um, for the late upload this week. And I think I uploaded late last week. It, it happens to me. Sometimes I get behind on my stuff. But anyway, that's going to be it for today. And uh, I hope you all check out the half acre beer co stacks of wheat golden wheat ale absolutely delicious so until next week stay safe be safe and i'll be seeing you guys